Hello, everyone. Join us this week as we talk about the powerful mercy of our God. This week, we have the Gospel of John, chapter 8, and we see that the Pharisees and the scribes have brought a woman to Jesus who has been caught in the very act of adultery, and they cause a frenzy. They put her in the middle, and they demand an answer from Jesus of what must be done with her. And of course, according to Jewish law, she should be stoned to death. We can see this pressure that is put on Jesus to act in accordance with the letter of the law, but instead he chooses to react with mercy. He doesn't say that the woman is innocent. In fact, at the end of this gospel, he says, has anyone condemned you? And she says, no, not one. And he goes, neither do I condemn you, but go and sin no more. And that is the disposition of our God. He is merciful and kind to us. Our God knows us and he knows our sins very acutely. He knows our sins better than we do, but he chooses to call us by our name. Whereas Satan, he knows our name, but he chooses to call us by our sins. When you and I go to confession, and even if we go over and over again, and some people will say, well, Father, I sound like a broken record. But you know, if we're going to confession and we're hearing those words over and over again, I absolve you of your sins, then we allow mercy to wash over us and it changes us from the inside out. Then we see the need to give mercy to other people. Trust in the mercy of our Lord Jesus. Let us not take it for granted. Our God is mercy who calls us to change.